Well, before I do any sort of weird speeding up or editing out a whole bunch of crap, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and take care of the levels the normal way, starting with the new gadget. Let's see how awesome it's going to be. Not very. It's so pathetic. And also, it the spring thing seriously looks like Atari level graphics here. This is what we've been waiting for this whole time. A spring-loaded boxing glove. I, I can't get over how stupid of an item this is. <laughs> it's so bad. But yeah, it... And it's amazingly powerful, somehow. Don't ask me how. So, yeah, um... When I first played this, like, a lot of this, a lot of the game was done, like, with my cousin, sort of either, like, me helping him play it, or he just helping me play it, and, like, we sort of went through it together, and he told me that the last item of the game was a tank. I wasn't sure how you'd be able to carry that tank, I that tank with you all the time, but it sounded freaking awesome. Instead, we get this stupid boxing glove. Never really fully recovered from that. But... Whatever. It's allegedly very powerful, so let's use it to break open those time capsules. Because a sword can't do that. A boxing glove can. Ugh. And why is there no staircase here? Well, there's supposed to be like little ledges sticking out of the wall. I remember those being there. Why are they not there anymore? Okay, finally I figured out how to get to the top of the stupid castle. Yeah, this is going to take a lot more editing than I thought. Which is to say, it's going to actually take some editing. So, got this stupid monkey. Hiding in a very inconvenient place. Let's go find some more that, fi that fit the same definition. Once again, I've gotten through all of Spectre's factory so I can destroy these boxes and finally reach the monkey that is presumably behind them. And I find myself without a monkey. What the hell? There's gotta be one. Do I break down this wall or something? I am a very confused panda right now. Um... Do I just go in there, maybe? Because this is like the last, the highest it goes, no? Okay, seriously though, what the hell, there's two left. Um, well let me go catch the one that I know for sure the location of. I was gonna go for this one first so I didn't have to climb up all those stupid conveyor belts again on screen. Wow, this segment really is turning out crappily, isn't it? Come on, survive it! Uh, sweet. So, yeah, we go back here, and... BAMF! Break open this wall, ignore the stupid spinny things. Got you. Now, where is the last one? Okay, it's also in this room. Where the hell is that? I did not know that area even existed. So, wait. Is it seriously just, like, over here? Yes. Yes, it is. Wow. I have wasted a lot of time. In, like, two different segments now, I assumed that there was a monkey at the end of that level behind the boxes. But, nope. Well, mystery solved, I guess. I can say that much. So, um... I'm not gonna bother cutting the segment here, because I can... I know the next one's just gonna be real close, so... Aside from all this loading screen and rigmarole... It'll just sort of be an in-and-out deal here. I think. 
because, yeah, there's the one in the time capsule outside here. And I think that's the only one. Yeah, it says 11 out of 12. It should be the only one. And this is right over here. Got... Hey. Got you. Not gonna say gotcha. It's got you. You must pronounce it correctly. Oh god, look at those cars. They're staying still, and there's reflections of moving buildings on them. That is so cheap. <laughs> That's actually really funny. Oh my god. Okay, so, um... I want to say that's the last of them, but it's saying that I'm not done with, uh... the Monkey Madness level, so... Let me see the total for this. Yeah, it says there's one more. Uh... That might just be Spectre. I'll do a quick look around the level off-screen and then get back to you on that one. Alright, there actually was one more. Uh, at Spectre's moon base, not to be confused with Dracula's moon base. Uh, there is another one here. I actually knew that was there and then completely forgot about it. So, gotcha. I believe you are the last regular monkey of the game now. Let's see if I get a special cutscene for it or something. After the unnecessarily loud noise, like always. Okay, uh, I th I'm hesitant to skip this, but just in case there's something. Nah, there won't be. Okay, what do we got now? I'm so happy! And I'm going to take care of about 50 other things first. Because, yeah, I don't have a lot of time, which means I'm going to have to be fast by doing time attack things. And I'm just going to do this. That is, like, the stupidest walk ever. So, yeah, I'll, uh, let me cut the segment yet again, see how much time I have left after all the editing, and maybe fit in some other crap. So, yeah, I've got enough time to do at least one level here. Uh, it says right there, press start to begin the time attack. Uh, this has no relevance whatsoever to the storyline. You just gotta get a good record on the time, basically. So you want to enter the level with the proper equipment, because uh, even when you're on the pause screen, it still counts. So you're going to always want to have the super hoop, that's for sure. The other ones is... It, it, um, they're more dependent on the level you'll want to know beforehand, but generally the setup I have now is a good one to have. Just got to be quick about it, and there we go. It said 45 seconds for a bronze medal. I'm not sure how much I needed for a gold, so let's see if I made it or not. I hope I didn't have to break 25. What's the lowdown? Yep, I did it. Sweet. And she always goes, I can't believe it. So let's try another one then. I got time for one more. And the number you have to get is usually different from the number the, uh, the first time you come in the level. So it's not always going to be the same strategies here. But basically, you just want to go after the ones that are the easiest to find, I guess. Uh, actually know where, knowing where I'm going would be very helpful, but eh, I can wing it. And then stuff like that will happen if I wing it. Alright, can I find some more? There's one. I don't know if I'll be able to dab it quickly. Maybe I will. And I think there's one underwater. There's one on a ledge, I know. Um, quickly find it. Oh yeah, I forgot. The, um, the chip things actually pause your timer. So, uh, collecting those can be part of your strategy as well. I completely forgot about that. Let's see if I, uh, I don't think I did good enough on this one, but uh, at least I learned a lesson from it. 
Let's see. Okay, I rock, but uh, uh, she can't. She can believe it. So it wasn't quite good enough. Uh, I'll I'll do that one off screen. You already saw me do it, I guess. Um, for the rest, I'm not sure what I want to do because I don't want to really have to go through all these one by one on screen. It's going to be kind of tedious to do that. So I'm probably going to speed them up. I don't really have any good music to put over it though, so I don't know. Figure something out. 